Well, hello there. I've been thinking about this, my house, and as much as I like what's going on here, I definitely feel that it's time to move it. Being where it is right now, it just kinda, it's just, it's, it's, it's in the way. I need to move it. I'm gonna work on that a bit, but I'm also going to be working on, oh goodness, I'm also going to be working on this area because as you can see, I got some workout equipment here. Don't really have too much else in the way of that, but um, here is Sprocket's house and he is total jock. There's Sprocket. <laughs> I want to turn this into an actual outdoor workout station. We'll see what else. I got a couple ideas, but I'm not sure on what I want to do. So I just wanted to record this opening bit because I definitely want to go outside, enjoy the sunshine, and I'm gonna take my Switch with me. And it's May, look at these violin beetles. What the heck? Well, hello there. It is now a few days since my past recording, but as you can see, I'm now changing up the museum area. And look at this statue of David. <laughs> it's huge. It's gigantic. I got it from Red. Um, he had all fake paintings when he visited, so I was sad about that. But I got this statue to put here, and it's huge. I thought this was like kind of a big thing. I <laughs> know. David over here. Just massive. Ta da! Look at this. So I got this part done like a couple days ago when I was initially recording but it's the next part that I've kind of been humming and hawing over. So, um, like this part was already pretty much filled in, but now I have them fenced in with ample space to walk about, and then the workout area over here on this side, just enough to fit what I had, and now it doesn't look um, cluttered, it gets the point across, and then it's still easy to come in and out. And I love that placing the fence um, from the opposite uh, direction will give you that little cross section which is perfect for these little entrances here and especially for these small parts like it doesn't make it look like I just set down one that it's kind of awkwardly hanging out there it looks like a succinct piece which is nice so yeah easy to come around in and then in the back here this is now where the laundry is so it's not in front of their doors then you know little flower gardens I think I want to put in some different various flower gardens for the different villagers and then they can each have like a different kind of flower or something like that so this happened my house is no longer here but I have this wonderful spot and so it does feel kind of weird to have it gone because I haven't like taken this area down yet but once I move this it's gonna open up a lot of space and the the source of my big dilemma here is ta -da, river's gone now we can come running through here and look at this this is cool so it was yesterday that red was in town so he was docked here my house was here it was cool but I wanted to go for like a flower field kind of look here, but it's kind of symmetrical and I'm not sure how I feel about that. I had the waterfalls from the previous setup and like all this water is gone, but I'm kind of feeling that symmetrical is not the way to go. I want to make sure I have access out to here for whatever. And then of course leaving the beach open. It's kind of nice to have this here, but after doing the front entrance and messing with that and not going for a symmetrical design I want to apply the same kind of philosophy here I'm just gonna leave it until I come up with a better idea because I'm gonna be putting up a bunch of stuff and then taking it down because that's what I already do <laughs> I can come over here and work on finishing this area up Almost 9 o'clock now, and the rain is letting up. 
and as you can see flowers have been planted and that's gonna look real nice when they're going in so I'm sticking with the red tulips in the middle row so I was able to replant what I had before and then just got more to, to plant there and then the other ones they're white wind flowers ha 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 surprise surprise they're gonna be kind of the main the main flower to go around the island and until we get something to go here I'm fine with it being empty there is one more thing I want to do with this section oh you see I was trying to put the spotlight in front so it works for Lady Liberty here but over here uh, David has a very funky footprint so even though that's where like the marble statue ends it takes up the half space in front of it which means I can't place the floor light Urgh, would have been a cool plant but that's okay it's okay so yeah once these flowers grow in that's gonna look pretty nice but with it being a museum in a very official formal area I do want to get some nice fencing to close this area off. I forget if I showed you, but I've installed a couple of mini workbenches around. I just have one on either side of the, the far sides of the island so far. And ooh, there's something I want to do for those, so we can do that as well. But for the museum's sake, we are crafting rope fences because this I think is very fitting for the museum. So I do have a couple of trees that need to move, but I keep running out of fruit, man. I guess I should replant these ones somewhere, but until then, we can still build the fence. Oh yeah, look at this. <gasps> wow. That's awesome. It auto adjusts to the, the size and everything. Look at that. Yeah, so if we just do enough to leave it open, so you can still kinda come through the main sections here. I think that looks good. Can't put it here, wow. What's up, man? Messing up my design. <gasps> what the heck, David? Okay, if I have him set here, then he won't let me move. All right, all right. We're gonna see if you're set up over here. Look at all the space there is to move around. His hitbox is weird. If we have you here, I don't know. Is that okay? I have to step through like that? I don't know anymore. All right, look at this. Aside from David being frenickety, I think we're looking pretty good. Instead of working on my house, I ended up getting this little neighborhood area. Hello, got this area going on. I like that the, these are red wind flowers that I have planted to match the back. So this is looking nice, it's very cleaned up and a nice little back section, a balloon. And then -da -da, this is looking much better and a bit more grand if I do say so myself. Well, uh, because over here, this works out perfectly fine. Anyway, not the biggest deal in the world. This is looking nice. I'm going to save designing my house section for when I have a better idea. I don't want to do a bunch of random stuff just yet. But until then, thank you for watching and stay tuned.